Welcome to the Inner Wonder. I'm Alex and I'm your host. Maya Angelou is a great warrior. Her words, poems and social activism demonstrate a person with courage, positive mindset and a fighting attitude. An attitude to be admired. An individual ready to go through any challenge along her way to achieving her goal and whose focus and determination is to be a lesson for all of us. An individual who is not fighting only for herself, but for every individual she represents. My favorite poem of hers, Still I Rise, demonstrates her character and spirit from the first to the last word. In this episode, I'll present a compilation of quotes by Maya Angelou worth to be read and discussed with you thinkers. Lesson 1. Words are things. You must be careful. They get on wallpapers, they get in your rugs, and finally, they get into you. As a powerful and influential writer, Maya Angelou places a lot of value in the power of words. She understands how powerful words can be and what an impact they can have in our society. Nowadays, in 2024, most exchanges of emotions between individuals happen through words. We observe sentences on walls and online, which carry with them hate, discrimination, attack and segregation. A society that thrives in division through words. Instead, the world could really become a better place if those words carried a sign of kindness, unity, and empowerment. Lesson 2. I don't trust people who don't love themselves and tell me I love you. There's an African saying which is, be careful when a naked person offers you a shirt. Through this quote, Maya stresses out the importance of self-love, self-acceptance, and zero shame about who we are and what we stand for. Maya is wondering, how can someone love others if they don't love themselves? Can this love even be real? What do you think, thinkers? In my eyes, one should start from the inner self before moving to others. Remember, if you want to change the world, start with the person in the mirror. Lesson 3. I've learned that people will forget what you said. People will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel. I'm sure you've seen this quote countless times. Indeed, it's a great quote. It provides insights on behavior for both personal and professional interactions. Thinking back to my childhood, it's hard to remember what my mother, my coach, my teacher, or any of my friends have said to me. But trust me, I do remember how they made me feel at various stages of our relationships. I'm sure, thinkers, if you think about your childhood best friend, emotions and not actions will overtake your memory. Lesson 4. There's no greater agony than burying an untold story inside you. To the ones who are not allowed to share who they are because they fear discrimination. To the ones who suffered and still nowadays continue to suffer this agony. To every single thinker out there who wishes that the world would simply accept who they are. I know what you're feeling. Maya Angelou understands the difficulty such people face by keeping into themselves an untold story. By having to lie about who they are and not being able to be the most authentic version of themselves. By having to bury deep their feelings and emotions. In this society, no one can rise. We all must understand how much agony an untold story creates. Sometimes thinkers telling that story might be better than keeping it inside. As difficult as it sounds. But for now, just the understanding of the agony it creates is a big step forward into a society more loving and kinder to one another. Lesson 5. You may shoot me with your words, you may cut me with your eyes, you may kill me with your hatefulness, but still, like air, I'll rise. This expression comes from the poem Still I Rise. It's an honest view into Maya's philosophy. It's a timeless message that talks to the hearts of all the groups of people that felt oppressed. Throughout the poem, she very clearly uses the words I and you to create an environment of personal ownership and responsibility, both for the oppressor and the oppressed. So what does this episode tell us about Maya Angelou? These are some of her core values. Number one, self-love is the utmost important value one should have. Number two, words are important to underestimate the use of them, but feelings will last forever. Number three, be proud of who you are and never give up on what you stand for. The values that are described through the five lessons we discussed today guided Maya Angelou through her life 
and enabled her to achieve remarkable success and to motivate and inspire a generation. Maya Angelou, you are the inner wonder of this episode. And with you, we shall still rise. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please consider subscribing to my channels and share my work on your social media. Until our minds meet again, enjoy the inner wonder you're creating. Thanks, everybody. See you next episode.